Hello and welcome to this video about setting up a union subquery in BMC Remedy Smart Reporting. In this video, we'll see how to set up a union subquery in BMC Remedy Smart Reporting to create a report displaying the number of incident and change requests. The union subquery operators allow users to combine the results of two SQL queries into a single table of all matching rows. For this, we need to create a master query first and then a union subquery to view the combined results of the two queries. So for this, on the IT home page, click applications, click smart reporting and then click smart reporting console. Now we'll create a report that displays the number of incident and change requests based on the assignee support company. To create a union subquery from the smart reporting console, click create, then click report. The create new window is displayed. From the create using field, we'll choose drag and drop builder, which is chosen by default here. So we'll keep it like that. And from the available data sources, We'll select Incident Management. Click Incident Management. The master query includes two incident management fields, assignee support company and the number of incident requests. So for this, we'll expand the incident details folder and we'll drag and drop these two fields to the columns section. So we'll select assignee support company and drag and drop this to the columns section. Next, we'll select the number of incidents and drag and drop this to the columns section. Now we'll add a label field to identify the incident and change record numbers. So on the data tab, click the plus sign on the bottom panel of the fields to create a label field. The calculated field dialog box is displayed. In the calculated field name, enter the name for the text that we want to create. Let's enter a label. In the formula type field, we'll select simple as we want to add a simple text field. In the formula box, enter a number of incidents. Click Add, click Save. We can see that a label is created under the calculated fields. Drag and drop this label to the column section. Now we'll change the analysis style to no drill. Click on the plus sign under the master query to add a subquery. The subquery type panel is displayed. Here, choose type union as we want to create a union subquery. From the style options, select advanced and then from the data source, select AR system and from the view, we'll choose change management. Click OK. We'll again add a label field for the change management view, just as we did for the number of incidents. So click the plus sign. The calculated field dialog box is displayed again. In the calculated field name, enter a label. Formula type will keep it as simple. In the formula box, enter number of changes. Click Add, click Save. As we can see, the calculated fields has a label under it. Now we'll link the master query fields to the subquery fields. For this, expand the change details folder and we'll drag and drop the respective fields. So we'll select Assigned Support Company and link it to the Assigned Support Company of the master query.
drag and drop number of changes to link it to the number of incidents. Now drag and drop the label to link it to the label of master query field. Now we have created a union subquery. By default, duplicate records are not displayed. So we'll select the show duplicate records option to view the duplicate results. Click save. Here, we can see a preview of our report. We can rename the columns and make our report easier to understand for the end user. So for this, Click the number of incidents drop down, click format and then click edit. In the display field, we will replace number of incidents with counts as the column shows number of incident and change requests. Click close. Similarly, click the drop down for the label column, click format and then click edit. In the display field, replace label with applications. Click close. The column name has been changed to applications. Now, click output. As we can see on the screen, our report shows the number of change and incident requests for each assignee support company, which is Carpro Services here. So in this video, we saw how to set up a union subquery in BMC Remedy Smart Reporting to create a report displaying the number of incident and change requests. I hope you found this video helpful. Thank you for watching.